born on February 14, 1922, Irving James Donahue grew up on the shore of Lake Quinsigamond in the Edgemere section of Shrewsbury. Jim attended Shrewsbury High School, graduated from Worcester Polytechnic Institute, and served in the Navy during World War II. After getting degrees from WPI and Harvard, Jim started working for American Steel and Wire. He eventually started his own business, Donahue Industries, which is located off Route 9 in Shrewsbury. In 1952, at the age of 30, Jim ran for and was elected to the Shrewsbury Board of Selectmen. He served as a selectman for 15 years and later for many years on the Finance Committee. As a selectman, Jim played a large role in developing the town manager, representative town meeting style of government that we still use now, over 50 years later. He also oversaw the building of a new high school, the current Oak Street School, and the building of the current town hall complex. Barbara was also busy during this time raising two daughters, getting a doctorate in Braille, teaching Sunday school, volunteering as a Girl Scout leader in the PTA, and achieving local fame as the Raggedy Ann Reader, traveling to many classrooms around Shrewsbury and reading to students. Jim and Babs Donahue passed on their love of Shrewsbury and commitment to community service to their daughters Susan and Judy, who both have been involved in the Shrewsbury Alumni Association and many other community organizations, including the Spirit of Shrewsbury Fall Festival, Scouting, and the SHS Music Association. By far the largest example of the Donahue's generosity is the facility that bears their name, the Donahue Rowing Center. The DRC is currently one of the largest facilities of its kind on the East Coast and includes many area high schools and colleges as tenants. Jim was always proud of the fact that the DRC is maintained and managed through funding that uses little or no Shrewsbury tax dollars. In addition to the buildings, the Donahues have donated many boats to both Shrewsbury and WPI crew teams. The DRC is one of the largest gifts the Donahues made to Shrewsbury, but certainly not the only donation. Some of the other gifts include a $50,000 donation to the Shrewsbury Historical Society, a hovercraft to the Shrewsbury Fire Department for water rescues, funding for a gym at the new firehouse for use by the Shrewsbury police and firefighters, equipment at the UMass Memorial Cardiovascular Department, and the Dean Park Fountains. The list goes on but the greatest gifts the Donahues gave and continue to give is a love of Shrewsbury and their commitment to community service.